so I live, what, maybe two or three minutes from here? Yeah. Uh, when I was following, I, well, on my way here, I was following a, uh, a septic tank truck. The poop truck? Yes, the poop, yeah, 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 okay, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. okay. Uh, interesting fact, they are not airtight. Ugh. <laughs> yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, Ugh. if you didn't know, my name is Philip Diaz. As always, is with me my stalwart commanded stalwart companion, Brandon <laughs> Whaley. Cheers, people. Tripping over my own words. <laughs> if you didn't know, this is the round. What up, brother? Not much, man. Not Good to much. See you. Drinking you a little wine, little vino. Oh, yeah. A little, little festive, vino. It is little the holiday season. I holiday think. season. Yeah. We're yeah. drinking the vino as, yeah. as one should. <laughs> Good to see you. You too, bro. Kind of back from hiatus. It's been a little while. Been a little long. Been a long time. I think we it. Yeah. As season always, one's done now. Time. So. Season, oh, okay. Yeah. Is that what we're calling that? So, yeah. Is that sure. what we're calling that yeah, break? Yeah. Season one? Yeah, season one. I'm okay with that. <laughs> I'll allow it. <laughs> um, it's December. Yes. What is today's date? I honestly don't even know what today's uh, date is. Today is the 11th. December 11th. December 11th. Mm -hmm. December 11th. December 11th. We're what? How many days from the, Christmas? The uh, 25th, 25th. So yeah. I don't do math. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> there you go. Uh, here's what I'm getting a lot of on the street. On the block. Yes. As, as people say. Uh, are you ready for Christmas? <laughs> are you ready for Christmas? Are, are, are you really ever uh, ready? I'm That's not, the thing. No. Well. I'm, I'm getting there, but, <laughs> but uh, no, but seriously, like it's the holiday season, you know, are you, have you done your shopping? What's going on? A lot of online shopping. Is that? Yeah. Yeah. No, I'm not. Really, See, I don't like the store thing. I don't know. I'm not a fan. Something always goes wrong. I'm not a fan. Are you uh, are you a Black Friday guy? Do you do, do, you do the Black not Friday? Not really. Did a little bit, but not really. You know, video games. Did you there. actually go out? <laughs> went to Best Buy. Um, did you? Oh, yeah, that's Buy. brave. Yeah, it was brave. That is that is brave. I, got, I, I think. Got, I got some pretty sweet deals, though. Did you really? Yeah, I got four video games for 57 bucks for right. PS4. All right. So Pretty amazing. So for the price of less than one, one game, I got four. You can't beat that. No. You can't no. beat that. I don't know. Granted, one of them was ordered online, but still. Yeah. You know. well, how were the crowds? Uh, I think they were all drinking. I think I saw a few people with flasks. So yeah. I think they were good. Yeah. They, they were, were they good. Were good. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm always nervous. I didn't get there right um, when they opened, so I didn't go through that whole process. Okay. You know, okay. Like where, where are they lined up? Is that how, like, even this? Yeah. Really? Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. yeah. I'm, all, I'm good with that. I am, uh... You wait like 10 minutes after you open, you just walk right in. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah. That's why yeah, yeah. it's kind of like a giant go to, go to, Yeah, go, you know to, go, I mean? to uh, you know, go to Friday's, have a yeah. drink. Yeah. Let the crowd yeah. kind of go in. Get an hors d'oeuvre, get an appetizer, yeah. get whatever, you know. Um, I, I'm constantly, I'm having that fight in my head between, like, Okay, so maybe there are some amazing deals to be had on that day. There are. There are. So yeah. Yeah. Um, but the same deals are going online too, which people don't they don't realize. Okay, yeah. Okay. So and yeah. most of the time it's free shipping, and sometimes it's even tax free. With so much of our purchasing habits yeah. becoming more online. Yeah. Um, I, I, you know, I don't necessarily worry about the brick and mortar stores, but I, I am mm -hmm. aware of what's going on. My question is. Is is it worth it? Is it worth it to go through the hassle? Is it mm. worth it? Like you know, like we heard about what happened in Kentucky. Yeah. Um. I, I want to say it was in Kentucky. I could be wrong about this. It may have been North Carolina, but it, it's somewhere but it's in, below the below yeah. the Mason Dixon. Yeah. yeah. Um. Where there was a big fight yeah. brawl. You know, guys guys went at it. What were they just, fighting over? Um. Yeah. Probably a gaming 20, system or something. Probably something that was they. Yeah. The equivalent of twenty bucks. A Bluetooth speaker. Yeah, yeah. Like, oh my god. There you go. There's Remember a, those were so expensive, but now they're like twenty bucks. Yeah, they're dirt cheap now, yeah. which is amazing. Yeah. But there's there's my my Black Friday habit or or tradition is to stay home. Yes. Go online and watch the fight because no matter no matter how it's violent no no matter how violent the fight is mm -hmm. for the twenty dollar DVD, Agreed. there's always some guy with like a camera. Like Filming watching the whole yeah. thing and uh, just throwing peanuts at him. Yeah, just, just like go. Yeah, 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 right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what, what was interesting uh, in me, to my opinion at least, was that um, this is not a new thing. Nah. Like uh, this is. Uh, I was watching a video, and you can look this up on YouTube. Uh, I wish. Uh, I wish I, I knew the link. Uh, of a, a cabbage patch. There was like oh, okay. a, there's a famous fight scene of like Toys R Us. It was like 19 This is like years ago. Yeah, this it's is amazing. years ago. Yeah, yeah. This is like when you and I were, were we we yeah. babes uh, of of like like so it's Toys R Us 1988. Mm -hmm. Let me set the scene for you. All right. It's snowing. It's so early the sun's not out yet. Right? So it's a dark 
I bet, it, I, bet was was the, R Us. I bet it was the Yakuza version, the animal it, it version. Feels, I bet it was. It was a, a Cabbage Patch? Yeah, yeah. They, 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 they had the animal version of the Cabbage Patch that came out. This was, this was, I, I think remember, I remember listen, that. I, okay, so the doors open, and they, like, they've got like a, like a Channel 13 mm-hmm. news crew there. And the guys just, it's just, like they're running. They're oh, yeah. running. It, it looks like a scene from like the Hunger Games. That's insane. And, and they're like, you've got two like you know like soccer moms mm-hmm. fighting for this one doll. That's insane. It was so like this is not a new thing. They Black actually, Friday has been going on for a while, and the violence and the this kind of like the. To, you know, it feels like Gladiator. Kind like of it really like, does. It feels like yeah, Gladiator. Yeah. Um, it's been going on for a so, while. So, 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 if you were going into a store on Black Friday, what would be a product you would fight over if you had to? Me personally, yeah, yeah, yeah personally. I, I, I don't, I don't think there's Just a product. If I had to, like, <laughs> Just ma- one item, ma- uh, like, ma- like you know, like if I got like a crazy deal on, yeah, yeah, maybe yeah. the Oculus Rift. Oh wow, yeah. Or the like if uh, the Morpheus, like, the Morpheus, like, that, yeah, like, yeah. The Morpheus. like if they were like, listen, we've got five Morpheuses, yeah, and they're going for like a hundred bucks. Yeah, yeah. Like my staff, I might, cu- I might, I might cut a dude. I might cut a brother. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Or a sister. Yeah. I don't yeah. want to be discriminatory. <laughs> like, he doesn't care as long yeah, as you get yeah, one. Yeah, as long as I get one, I'm cutting you. That's funny. Uh, so that might be, you know, I just, I, you know, I, I do think you and I, and I, to your credit, like yeah. this. We shop online now. Oh yeah. Um, yeah. I didn't do that until you came. You were like, Phil, Amazon, this is yeah. the thing. I was un- completely I mean, there's places with no shipping. Yeah. And, places and, and no usually and- usually maybe like ten to twenty percent cheaper than oh, yeah. if you were to get it yeah, yeah. at a brick and you don't motor. have to get in your car and drive yeah, there and yeah. you know. Listen, I'm a fan of anything that lets me do that activity in mm-hmm. my underwear. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? Like, like if I can shop in my underwear, I I'm want a job in my underwear. Yeah. To be yeah. Like, are you telling me I don't have to leave my home? Yeah. I don't have to leave yeah. my cloistered egg. Yeah. So, so happy holidays <laughs> to you and yours is what basically, we, what we I'm hope saying. you're all having eggnog during <laughs> yeah. this session here. Lots of it. It'll make us look a little prettier. Let's, too, um, so. all right. So that's the holidays. Okay. Yeah. Holiday episode. We've discussed that. We have. Um, what I really wanted to talk to you about uh, was we are okay even closer than Christmas. Yes, uh, is the new Star Wars film. Yes, uh, basically a week from now. Is it really about yeah, a week? Yeah, yeah, about a week. I'm, yeah. I'm sure we're going to see. I'm sure Thursday everyone night, else is going to see you know, it. Thursday night, but Friday's the yeah. Day. Would you do? Yeah, it's kind of in the same vein of mm-hmm. the of the Friday Black Friday thing. Like, are you yeah. going to go see it opening night? Are you going to be a Thursday midnight guy? I know. I'm doing. I'm doing the Friday night at seven fifteen. You know? Friday night. Yeah. Okay, so it's, that's I'm still, still scared. Still, I'm still very frightened. By yeah, that. it's still going to be pandemic. I would have never chosen that. The but. movie has already grossed. Yeah, like the first, like there's opening nights, and then for select people who live in, I believe California mm-hmm. or Florida, mm-hmm. which is really cool. I actually know someone who's doing it. They they will be watching it in in Disney. Mm-hmm. It's this very kind of very being that it's owned by Star Wars. Yes, Disney exactly. Star Wars Star Wars now. Yeah, so yeah. they're going to do a day before private screening. That makes sense. Uh, coupled with this new kind of theme park that they've mm-hmm. opened, where you can kind of walk through. It's kind of cool. Yeah, like it's it's not so much a theme park as it is like you walk through and it looks like the cantina on Mos yeah. Eisley. Another part of it looks very similar to the interior of the Millennium Falcon. That's kind of cool. So yeah, so like, so there's- What do they yeah. charge for something like that, I wonder? Uh, I, uh, I I know someone who's going. Yeah. Um, I, we didn't get into specifics, but I believe the term arm and a leg oh, okay. came up. Oh, so they so, took that alone to yeah. go to this. Well, okay, let's, you're talking like, but about- But I met a Wookiee, it was yeah, fun. Yeah. I met a Wookiee. The price, <laughs> really, like, <laughs> You know, the price, uh, you know, was that the day, like, yeah. credit card commercial? Yeah. <laughs> you know I mean? It's like, met a, priceless. Wo- met a Wookiee and I was drunk. Priceless. priceless. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, I'm totally okay with that. Um, but speaking of pricing, you've already paid for your ticket. Yes, yes. Now, you were going to see it opening, not Thursday at midnight, but opening day. Opening day, yeah. Friday. Yeah, yeah. What did that set you back? Like, it's 20, not 20 bucks. 20 bucks. It's IMAX 3D. So I did it through Fandango. There's a service fee of two dollars. Not exactly sure what the service fee is for because I'm literally the one typing in everything. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Don't know what the it's service like fee is for. Credit card, uh, like, like yeah, yeah. Keyboard it, fatigue. It just says two dollar additional service fee. All I was right, like, all right, all right. Well, guess I got a ticket though. All right, thanks, George so, Lucas. Is yeah. that, <laughs> what is that? That's a yeah. that's a George Lucas. It's kind tax? of like a pizza delivery fee. 
Even though the guys don't get that fee, yeah, which is kind of yeah. messed up. Well, he gets wear and tear on his vehicle. No, but he, no, he it's, pays it's, the it's gas. I, apparently this is like a huge thing in the pieces. You're talking about pieces. We're segueing from Star Wars a to little pieces. bit, just for a quick no, second. That's fine. Like right back I just to Star want to make Wars. Sure. Something yeah. I learned like last week. Yeah. So the pizza delivery fee actually does not go to the delivery driver. It goes back to the house because pizza is so expensive. They had to find a cheaper way to market so down in price. So they sneak it in. They sneak they it sneak in. They sneak it yeah. in. With all these, like, I feel like what I'm going to call, I don't want to say bad. Bad's not the no. word I want to use. But, like, let's say, let's say, like, your average pizza place. Yes. Domino's, Pizza Hut, mm -hmm. Papa, Papa John's. John's. Mm -hmm. Like, the places yeah. that, you know, you know. Mm -hmm. um, I do feel like their prices, prices have gone way down lately. Yes. Like, they've got crazy deals. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, so yeah. there's that sort of thing. And... But that's yeah. where they sneak but it. But so they snuck it in. Yeah, yeah. And to bring it back to Star Wars, mm -hmm. that's how you know. Yeah, they did the same thing. Sneaking it in. A service fee. How many how many uh IMAX 3D films have you seen? Because I've seen a lot with you. I've probably seen at I've least, seen a, a at baker's least, dozen? Probably. Perhaps. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A baker's, a baker's dozen. dozen? Yeah, a baker's dozen yeah. works. Google it. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, so and how much is you know, if you were to lump them up, on average, how much you're spending? Not counting food. I would say I would say dollars. just just for the ticket alone, usually on an average is between thirteen and fifteen. Okay, so I, I was gonna say I was gonna say sixteen yeah, yeah. to. We do want we do go to the matinees. We yeah. do try to catch the we cheaper do the old man shows. Yeah, we do. Hey, <laughs> don't be knocking the old man shows. There's no Another kids. Road. Nobody's yeah. screaming. You yeah. can actually get the. There's whole like movie one in. kid, and we all stare at him. Yeah. so he does yeah. not talk. It never comes um, back again either. All right, so yeah, I think that's a fair. I think a fair price. Mm -hmm. I, mean, I may have skewed a little bit higher. Yeah, I may have maybe like between like thirteen to sixteen. Yeah, I said thirteen, fifteen. Yeah. Close so enough. no, I'm sorry. Yeah. I, I, I do. I think maybe like eighteen. But okay. what I'm saying is, my point being is that there is a much like I feel like there's a Star Wars tax. Oh, yeah, there is. I there's think a there total. They're it's like. A, they're like a, you. It said GL on it. Yeah. I, don't know, I don't know what that means. <laughs> ST Star Wars yeah, tax. Yeah, so like, yeah. Oh, Joe, George. Yeah, yeah. And there was, there was a, another a symbol that said THX on it. Also, yeah, I'm not really right. sure what that there, was. Yeah, right. So. Oh, wait, wait. Do you wait? Do you want the real Star Wars? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. There you go. How many GL THX? Yeah. What does that mean? Is a Wookiee tax? Like, yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? Well, we're gonna give you two. We're gonna give you new Wookies, and of course, what's his name? So they did say yeah. the ticket would smell like Wookie, so I was like, all right, you can have my Listen, service fee now. That's fine. I'm okay so, with that. Yeah. I'm okay with like honestly, all kidding aside, <laughs> like if they gave me like a scratch and sniff yeah, yeah. Star Wars ticket that yeah. was like, and it was wet dog, yeah, and but they called it Wookie, yeah. I'd be, I'd be, <laughs> I'm like, oh, that's so good. That's fucking Alderaan all over uh, again. Apparently, Ben and Jerry's has a flavor coming out. Are you Wookie. fucking kidding me? No, I made that. Oh, up. okay. I was gonna lose. I was gonna lose. It. You know what it would have been? It would make sense. It would have been. It would have been chocolate chip and Alpo. Like it would just been like, and I would have been like, I'm like, no, it's really complicated. This is like, no, I can get behind this. Like, and like, just you got, you, you got, got a, you got a guy in the background. He's like, this tastes familiar. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay, so there is a bit of a Star Wars tax. Yeah, there is yeah. a bit of, uh, there, you know, like it, they're 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 raising the prices. I think a little bit. Yeah. And I don't want to say it's justified because a movie's a movie's a movie. Yeah. Um, but are are you gonna pay it? I did. Yeah, I did. And so am I, to be perfectly clear. Like I'm, the I'm you know, crazy mine. part is, is when you go to Fandango, which I, I never buy tickets from Fandango, but I, apparently that was the only place I'd get tickets from. Really? I mean, I could go there and take the chance, but I didn't want to do that. Well, as I understand it, the first day is actually already sold out. Yeah, it's already sold out, but I was actually able to get it for the 715 showing, which I was surprised That's amazing. By. Yeah, I was, I'm very I was amazed by that. that. But it's scary. It's, it was a real scary process when doing this because they put a timer. So you're you're, you're typing and you've got a really? timer, a countdown timer. And now this and is if, on the Fandango website. Yeah, if you miss the timer, you have to start all over. Now, is that for all their movies or this is a specific? I don't know. You I don't typed know. in the word S. They were like, Star Wars, bitches, timer. Yeah, yeah. Like, like five minutes to put all your information and credit card information in, your address. Really? You got to type all the shit in and like you have five minutes and it says... In big bold print, if you do not finish this within five minutes, you have to start over. You, so I, I got down to like forty nine oh, seconds, and I'm like freaking shit. out. I'm like, it was like a bomb. I'm listen, go off. I'm listen. I'm trying. You know how I'm like know? service fee. Holy shit! What is what is this? What's you, going on? Do you know yeah. how long it takes me to order a pizza yeah. online? Oh yeah. Like I've got to order if I want to eat at eight. I've got to start at four. Oh yeah. yeah. Like, I'm like yeah. no. I don't know what kind of. They give you a five minute <laughs> countdown timer. I don't, that's a lot of pressure. It was it listen. was it was really freaky. Like I thought the listen. Millennium Falcon was actually going to blow up. I can't. Yeah. Like yeah. Like you. I was like, like, I was like, I'm gonna kill everybody yeah. here. Stay on yeah. target. 
Yeah, it was, it was terrible. What, t- <laughs> what time do we want to go? <laughs> Stay on target. <laughs> I, I think they do it to pressure you into making sure you get that ticket. You know what I mean? Because it's I like, just, I, it was a race. I, I think a lot of it is it was really because intense. they were in, I, I, I'm telling you right now, I would have panicked. Mm-hmm. Like, I would have just iPad off. No, I did it, no. I did it while we're on gonna, the phone. We're going to wait a week. I did it while week. on the phone with my girlfriend making sure I was getting the ticket. Because she already has one. So she's like, you got to get this ticket, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. I'm typing it in. Countdown timer's going. I have never heard of it. It was the most yes. nerve wracking yeah. like, experience of buying <laughs> I mean, Give me your goddamn credit card. <laughs> you're just there, right? You know what I mean? You're just typing it in. You're just like, what? 473. I said 473. <laughs> Yeah, like I couldn't. It I was couldn't it was about. awful. It was awful. That's you know. But what, I got a ticket, so yeah, it was and, worth and, it. You and know, the opening night, the force was with me. The f- <laughs> hey, well, well, ladies and gentlemen, if you didn't know, my name is Philip Diaz. As always, with me is Brandon. Wait, wait, sir. That was that was like a, that was very. I like that. The that force was a good was one. Me. The force was with you. That, very cheeky. cheeky <laughs> um, what I wanted to talk about sure. uh, as we close it out, because mm-hmm. um, I'm not really sure what we talked about before that. Um, was I wanted to talk about uh, the fact that Star Wars and, and once again I'm not fact checking this the first movie came out in 1978 eight. Eight or, okay eight I believe it was eight yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna choose to believe actually you no know, 77 I'm sorry are you sure yeah, okay. yeah right. 77 alright I was all it came out before we were born yes it is literally over a 30 year franchise yes that's how old Star Wars mm-hmm. is it's literally before we were born, and Wookies never age, and Wookies and Wookie, True everybody story. else does. But yeah, Wookiees never yeah. Age. You looked at you looked at Chewie. He looks younger. Actually, you looked you know. at Chewie. No, there's a little gray. I think he's like there's a little. Button. I think he's going in reverse. Actually. Is that? Yeah. There you go. I'll tell you who's not, and that's Han Solo. Oh Holy God! Shit. Yeah. The man broke his toe. No, broke his leg. leg. Was it his it was leg? leg okay. Yeah. And J.J. Abrams is too old, old for that. Old Harrison Ford on the set. They just kind of wheeled him out. Apparently, like, and Abrams like, pushed the button on the door that was shutting, and it shut on Harrison Ford's God. leg. So they well, hate each other now. You know what? To be fair, that yeah. old fuck should have moved faster. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, But they're but, killing him off, so. Yeah, they're, they're killing him <laughs> off anyway. Spoilers. Yeah. Uh, we haven't seen it. Um, that's a rumor. Well, we are psychic, I think. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> moving on. Well, Harrison Ford said that. He said he, he was like, I, that I never want to be in the franchise rumor. again. You have to kill me off. Yeah, that was, yeah. So. He's like, I'm going to do one. He's like, I will die in this movie. Yeah. Just so My I'm guess would be for a huge paycheck. Yeah. A huge paycheck. He took American Graffiti too, though. So <laughs> He did. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I, truth be told, I love Harrison Ford. He's my... He, next to... Next to... Um, Calista Flockhart? No, 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 no. Uh, he Sorry, was, Harrison, what we, I, we mentioned your wife in this one. What I, what I was going to say is that ne- uh, he's my favorite old, cranky old guy. Oh, yeah, actor. yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? Next to uh, the guy who did Dirty Harry. Yeah. Uh, well, one thing I could say that Spielberg, you know, I thought this was great. Spielberg said there will never be a Indiana Jones that was played without without Harrison. Yeah, he, yeah. he just won't he's be gonna, yeah, yeah, he said yeah. And I respect that because it won't yeah. be. Yeah. But but that means the franchise should be dead. It should be. Um, it should you be. know, I don't. He's too. It should be. No, that that that, that part. But is I still it. like the idea of Chris Pratt being Indiana Jones. That I'm still totally lingering on that, that idea. I'm totally so, down for that. Yeah. Um, we went off the rails there for a that's second. That's okay. I'm okay. That's what we do. Yeah. That's, that's what, it's why boots. It is. It is. Ball. It is what we do. Yeah. Um, my my uh, final thoughts on Star Wars. Sure. Uh, what. Do you have a Star Wars memory? Is there is there a unique story that you have connected to a fictional franchise that, admittedly, the world loves? Star Whatever. Wars. Yeah, which is yeah, yeah, yeah. So you, I, you know, I would say I have one. I can start. I, first I would say yeah. But I mean, I remember being a small child and living in Michigan at the time and sneaking out of my bedroom to go watch Home Box Office. If anybody doesn't know what Home Box Office is, it's HBO. Oh, oh, before HBO yeah, yeah, was before, HBO. Yeah, yeah. It used to be called Home Box Home Office. Box and office. Then it went to HBO to yeah, start it up. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. So, wait, so it said the scene. So, you're, you're like, you snuck out of your bed? Yeah, I would, I would yeah. Oh, my parents where were your parents? parents? They were asleep. Yeah, okay, so they were yeah, passed out. They were passed I would out. sneak out and go How watch. old are you? How, uh, I'm assuming like you were. Probably four or five. You, you were a six foot four, I was five like, year yeah, old. I was like, I was Wookiee size. Wookiee size. You know? You still are. Oh, yeah, you it's still really, it's really You're a tall man, Brandon Whaley. I ate a lot of waffles as a kid. Yeah. All right, so you'd sneak down, five years old. Yeah. I, I would sneak down and I would I would turn on Your HBO. Your parents had cable. I'm a huge movie buff and I would turn yeah. on HBO and they would be asleep and I my favorite thing was stay up all night and watch movies 
and then go to preschool. So this was a thing. School. This was like a thing. I did this every night. So like for five years. And I'm still like, doing it. Yeah. <laughs> like you're just like, hey, baby, you sleep? Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. All right. So so you're five. So that so your first. So you saw Star Wars by yourself. By myself, yeah. yeah. At like three o'clock in the morning. Yeah. Yeah. That's kind of dope. Like, it, was, that's it, was, a, it was fun. That's, you know a, I mean? that's a like, Han Solo kind of yeah, story. I, you yeah. like, fuck yeah. you. Yeah. I'm going no, I, I, I did that and you know, I, awesome. I entered the dark side when I was doing that. Yes. And, you know, I would I would sneak down and, and watch HBO and that's how I caught Star Wars. So, so okay, so we probably okay, my See, that's, and, that's a good and story. To be, and to be honest with you, I don't know if it was the if it was the first one or the second one or yeah, yeah. You may have you seen know. them out of order. Yeah, it yeah, probably was. Yeah. I just um, remember that's how I saw it. It's kind of the same thing with me, mm-hmm. where where I never saw the original, you know, the five, six, and seven. Yeah. in in the theater, we missed yeah. that. I yeah. missed that boulder. We were too, when the last two came out. I was like a fetus. Yeah. So it wasn't going to happen. Um, but I I remember. I remember them being in my home on VHS, mm-hmm. and I remember being like, like, like it was like, like everyone, like my uncle, like people would come by. Oh yeah, and and they were like, oh, what are you guys, gonna, you know, like like family would come for dinner, and they would leave, and then it was like it was like, oh, what are you doing? Oh, someone got that mm-hmm. on like VHS and put it in, and then like we just all kind of sat there quietly, just a bunch of like five or six Puerto Ricans, just, yeah. just kind of just watching Star Wars. Just be like, they were like, I like, I like, I like the sword. They were, you know, like, we were just, it was a good, you know, and I remember that. And uh, my favorite uh, Star Wars experience, and I'll make this very brief, uh, was when I saw, and which is weird because it's this movie, it was the episode one, mm-hmm. the one with the kid. Yeah. Uh, Attack was, of the Clones. No, the one before that, a new no, not a new hope. The the first episode one, Star Wars with the little kid, the only one he did. Yeah, oh, it was um, it was uh, what the hell was it called? Yeah, see, this Star Wars, the pod racing movie. Yes, the there pod racing. Yeah, yeah, it was okay. called the pod racing movie. Yes, that's exactly yeah. what it was. I saw now when that came out. I think I was in high school, mm-hmm. uh, and I was actually working at the movie theater. Mm-hmm. Uh, that is the most engrossing movie going experience I ever had. Yeah. Uh, we like there was like for some reason there was a guy who decided to give a speech talking about it. I had taken the day off, um, and he just talked a little bit about the sound system, about what was going on. People were dressed up. Yeah. People were clapping awesome. uh, before the movie. Mm-hmm. There happened to be a guy with a red lightsaber, and there happened to be a dude who was dressed up exactly like Obi. And there was an impromptu lightsaber, and like everybody was on board. <laughs> like, and, like there was like the theater was packed. Uh, if I didn't say it, it was opening night, and like, like we were like, no, we want to see how this fight plays out. When you see, like, it was like it was such. A, a community, you know, it was a community thing. Like everyone in that room, yeah, was collectively geeked out together. That's and the beauty, was, and that I thing—that's the beauty. That's, right that's my like. That's what makes Star Wars. Like it's, there are dudes in Ethiopia mm-hmm. who were like, "Ooh, Jedi." It's, the, it's, <laughs> it's, it's, it's like the one day when it comes out, or it's like the, yeah. it's the one show where everybody nerds out. It is, yeah. You know what I mean? It that's, is, that's the best part about it. And it's. it's you may be a president, you may be a governor, you may be this and that, but you might be rocking a lightsaber. Yeah. Just because secretly. this came out. See, here, you know what I mean? Um, and, and this will be my, my final thought on it. Uh, I think at one point in everyone's life, mm-hmm. everyone has done this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> everyone's yeah. like, well, I don't I'm know. still doing that. I don't, yeah. And it's never oh, working. No. I'm like peanut yeah, butter. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. At some point, I think in everyone's life, everyone's like, well, I. You know, I can you, tell you this. It's like eventually, when it does happen, I will freak phone. out. You yeah, know what I, mean? I knew it. I'd be like, I'm never going to work again. Yeah. Peanut butter. Call it a day. Call it. <laughs> <laughs>